Hey, what's up guys? This is my Nerve tutorial, Nerves from x for Records, and it's a mini sequencer plugin that deals with uh, one-shots, samples, and loops. So we'll drag that in here. This is what you will see when you first open it. So I'll just do a basic uh, overview, and then we'll get into all the little little bits of it. So up here we have our browser, and you can browse through patterns, kits, and sounds uh, once you pick one. Uh, we have a swing function here swing drop down menu always fun we have a through l which are uh, like your pattern selection so you can have pattern variations and you can switch between them all midi mappable uh, we have uh, chain so that would be the length of the loop you can have it eight bars long or between you know one and eight bars long uh, we have a random button which will go to a random a bar this is more for live performance uh, we can record we can have our click track on or off and that's all well and good down here in this window is our sequencer this is the bread and butter there's two modes one shot mode which you have like these velocity stocks and loop mode which you select down here and that will be kind of like fruit loop slice x but a lot more better uh, so velocity is like basically no trigger but the velocity is how loud the note is like the, the velocity of it and you can even sequence cutoff resonance pitch pan gate uh, lateness so you can kind of do like an artificial shuffle which is pretty cool and effects send right so we have uh pads down here we have 16 pads traditionally you know machine has 16 pads uh akai like mpc da -da -da -da, all these all these classic drum machines have 16 pads it's just kind of a tradition and you can select them and when they're blue they're selected and you can load in sounds and we'll get into that later you load in sounds you load in loops and you select whether it's a one shot or a loop you can adjust the attack decay uh the hold sustain and release solo and mute you can also alt click for solo and mute and shift or control click for mute right so it's all context sensitive um yeah you have all your pads here you can have 16 uh, down here is our state variable filter and our outputs selection and uh, MIDI kind of stuff here and uh, filter smoothing, which we will get into over here, which load, which is how you load in samples. It's pretty neat how it works. Um, offset, so if we say if we have a clap, we can offset it. It's kind of like late, but a little bit different. Uh, group choke, um, each, each, this is all... Uh, pad sensitive so this changes per pad but group choke we'll get into that later uh, volume pan pitch fine and our side chain I was kind of confused how this worked but it's actually pretty pretty straightforward and intuitive uh, once you get into that and uh, yeah that is pretty much the overview we have our stutter section here and this is more of the live performance dotted in triplet and our uh, send dry and wet and uh, you can have uh, MIDI going into that and it's pretty nice um, overall master volume and yeah did I show you yeah oh yeah this is a uh, kind of like another sequencer so we can have just a single pad we can see a single pad or we can have them all on one screen which is a very nice feature we'll get to that as well and a mix this is like a mixer so I thought of everything and uh yeah we're gonna have some fun it's excellent workflow and yeah hope you like it and we will be back